Okay, I feel like that water was very appropriate because very we inviting. are riding. Yeah, we are talking about uh, the latest craze here in Western North Carolina, stand up paddle board surfing. And to tell us all about it is Sarah Merle and Samantha Pope with Diamond Brand. Hey, thanks for joining us, ladies. Thank, Thank you. you. I'm loving this outdoorsy gear. I feel like Karen and I might be a little overdressed. What do you think? <laughs> Maybe Not at all. a little bit. <laughs> all right. So tell us about this. Um, we got this big giant board in front of us. How does this work? Okay, um, well, stand up paddle, paddle boarding basically originated in Hawaii where surf instructors would take out their longboard and so that they could get video of their students and they would mount the camera to the top of the paddle um, and they would get the video. Okay. And it eventually became a sport all of its own and basically um, you just stand on the board and paddle it and it's a great workout because you're using your arms to paddle the board. Um, but you also have to stabilize it using your core muscles and your legs. So it's a really great full body workout um, and a cardiovascular workout as well. And Is it something that anyone can just jump in there and do or do you need to do a little training before you just get on the board and try to paddle? Well, it certainly is a balancing act, and it's something that you need to get used to because it is unlike anything else. But um, once you get used to it, I think you'll find that it is a lot of fun. And you do this in lakes. Where, where is the most common place to do stand-up paddle boarding? Well, around here, you can take it down the French Broad River. A lot of people do that, as well as some lakes in DuPont and other places locally around here. Okay, and so, it, it, you know, when I think about the French Broad, that flows pretty quickly, so you can still do it if it's the water is really rushing, I guess. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, yeah, there's um, whitewater paddle boarding, and um, we actually have different boards that are better for whitewater, and then there's some boards that are better for flat water. I see. So, so depending on where you're going, you want to consider what sort of equipment that you're going to be buying. Is that right? Absolutely. Right. Okay. All right. And can you rent this equipment anywhere? Do you know? Um, well, actually, at Diamond Brands, um, we do demo days every Wednesday from 4 to 6 p.m. It's totally free. All you have to do is call our store and um, tell them what you're interested in taking out and we'll bring it to Lake Julian for you. Oh, and cool. So you can give well, it a go. So yeah, do you guys mind getting on the board and sort of giving uh, us a little uh, a show and display? Well, absolutely not. That's what I'm here for. Okay. Um, the best way to get on a paddle board, which is sometimes the hardest part, um, but it's easiest to get on uh, when you're in waist deep water and first kind of roll onto it like you're rolling into bed almost. <laughs> and you'll start out on your knees you're going to want to brace yourself with your paddle and holding it just like this, almost in a lunge position. And the easiest thing to do is just to get up all at once so that you don't fall over. Okay. And does it take more than one try sometimes? Sometimes, <laughs> it sure does. So you always want to wear the right gear in case you do go for a little bit of a swim. And so just your basic stroke, just like this, and then to turn, you can step back a little bit. But you always want to keep your feet pretty central on the board just to keep your balance. Mm -hmm. Okay, and so if, if people want to do, you said uh, Diamond Brand uh, does uh, some, some practice tests or will right. take you out, what, what's the best number to call or how do they get in touch with you guys? Um, well, at Diamond Brand, you can just call 828-684-6262 um, or you can visit our website, which is www.diamondbrand.com. Um, and we've got info on it. Okay, so. cool. Thank you so much, guys. This looks like a lot of fun. Yeah, thank All you. Right. And uh, coming up, we'll have a look at your top stories and a final check of your weather and one last visit, of course, with Bruce. Stay with us.